Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be unboxing Daku Farm. As always, there is 12 basic designs and a secret. The secret is actually a Daku on a wheelbarrow and it's actually pretty cute. Box number one. One. First figurine of the day is Scarecrow. And this is the card. This Deku is so cute. And he's holding a little sparrow on his right hand. But he does not look like a scarecrow to me. I would think usually scarecrows are standing on a stick. But he seems to be standing on his two little web feet. His hair kind of reminds me of french fries for some reason. I like the detail in the pet shop work on his shirt as well. I think it looks really cute. This is how he looks like from the back. He is giving off Halloween vibes even though Halloween just passed. Box number two. Another dust bag. Ooh! <gasps> this one is called Farmer. This is the card. And I did not realize this just now, but turning over to the side, you see he has a little ducky butt. It's so cute. So this Daku looks a little bit older than the previous one. He has a beard and he is holding a shovel. You know what this hat reminds me of? Sophie from Howl's Moving Castle. She wears the exact same hat, if I'm not mistaken. I think her ribbon is pink as well. But yes, it reminds me of Sophie from Howl's Moving Castle. Last box. This one feels heavy. Heavier, at least. I got the one I wanted! This is Rice Sack. And this is the card. He has got to be the cutest out of the whole set. I think his design is pretty simple. It's just Daku wearing a Rice Sack suit, holding a bunch of wheat. But it's so cute. And turning him over, this is actually Chinese or Kanji for rice. And I'm not sure if you can see the detail. It is a little bit dirty. And I think it's on purpose because a rice sack in general is not very clean. Wow. This is a nice one. I love it. This is a 360 degree view of rice sack. I think out of the three figurines that I got today, this one has got to be my favorite. He's definitely the cutest out of all of them. Next up, we have Farmer. Although he's not one of the characters that I wanted, but seeing him in real life makes me realize actually how good he looks. So I really can't judge a book by its cover. And last but not least, we have Scarecrow. I think he's one of the characters where I wouldn't think I would like it, but after seeing him in real life, I actually realized that he is a very detailed character. So I'm quite lucky to get him. And that is all for today, guys. Thank you all for watching, even though it's a very short unboxing. But I will see you guys in my next video. Bye bye!